good morning welcome back to another vlog i want to start off by saying thank you so much to everyone who commented on the last vlog and just left the kindest comments i got dms from people i knew messages like so much love and support and it truly means the freaking world to me so thank you i'm feeling a lot better i'm feeling like pretty much back to myself thanks to this one <laughs> and to just like you know taking some time feeling what i'm feeling instead of trying to like rush through it or whatever and just letting myself be sad letting myself feel all of the emotions you know and we took some time and like went out to eat with friends like went on cute little rooftop double dates and last night we had like a little love island viewing party with our friends it was like the recoupling for casa amor which i mean drew and i are watching it on the vpn on the laptop now so we're like currently caught up so we just re-watched it but played some board games and my friend made like an entire presentation to bring a couple of the guys that like hadn't seen it up to speed and it was just so much fun and so yeah i'm just feeling a lot better my mom's actually coming to town next weekend so today is saturday she'll be here on friday so that'll be really fun but this morning what we're doing now that we're back up to the current day we are going to lowe's right now and we're going to get some stuff to like redo the backyard so we've kind of like done a little bit of stuff this morning but basically we're getting like some river rocks to put in and we're just gonna like make over the space we've kind of started but hopefully by the end of this we'll have like a finished product if not we'll be well on our way so let's go to the hardware store we go where I am never a more useless version of myself me too oh yeah do you want to look at them bunch of bags of river rocks some privacy screening i'll show you everything when we get home and it was 147 dollars so that's pretty good for like a renter friendly you know we're not going to get that money back but it's pretty good for like a patio makeover Made it back home and here is a quick haul of what we got we got some river rocks uh this is definitely not enough these were only five dollars a bag though and we got six bags so that's as comfortable as we feel with that we got some soil because all of these plant pots actually came with the place like they were like buried in this like little area over here and so we decided to just empty them all out because they were all like disgusting so we're gonna plant some new things in here and we got some new plants to go in them. We got a couple plants, couple flowers, couple vegetables. And then we might also try to find some strawberry seeds. We also got a little watering can. We got a citronella candle for bugs. I got some gloves and we got some ties to tie up the privacy screen. So that's what we have so far. It's hard to tell, and I wish I had gotten some more before shots, but to be honest, I kind of didn't think of it. <laughs> but it already looks so much better. And those bags of rocks were only $30. Like, that's pretty great. So I'm happy with that. We're gonna rinse these off because they're just like absolutely covered in dirt, but nice start. Before, after. <laughs> that is crazy. This is so satisfying much satisfaction oh much doing this yeah it looks a million times better cheese louise it looks so good taking a quick lunch break before we get back out there and start like repotting our plants and stuff but i wanted to freaking tell you guys about this place that we've been discovering so if you're ever like visiting la or if you live in la there's a place called sum sum and we just discovered it on Postmates one day. It's like a Mediterranean place and it is so good. This bowl is absolutely massive. So, or we got like a plate, but you can get like wraps, pitas, all sorts of stuff. I get mine with falafel. And this time I tried something new. I tried Mediterranean salad 
and I got cucumber salad, but the Mediterranean salad has cucumber, so it's just like a lot of cucumbers. It also has um, like deep fried eggplant, their homemade hummus, which is like so smooth and creamy, the falafel, and then underneath it, it has Israeli couscous and like a turmeric rice. And then we get like different sauces to go with it. I think this is like a spicy tahini or something. This is a tahini. Drew gets like a garlic paste and he gets um, the chicken breast. Chicken and it's breast, so Israeli pickle. Oh yeah. Marinated onion. Yeah, it looks really good. And my new um, spicy water obsession that Drew and I have been fighting over is called Aha. And it's the flavor lime and watermelon. And Drew said it reminds him of like um, Capri Sun kind of, like that sort of taste. I mean, obviously like one tenth of that taste because it's sparkling water, but. Hi, I'm dirty, I just realized I have like dirt all over me. Anyways, I just wanted to tell you about this food because it's so delicious. So if you ever get the chance, definitely try it. Now. Layla's crying because we have food. So a little while later, we've eaten lunch and uh, we got a wild hair up our ass and decided to come to Ikea. We're at Disneyland. We're <laughs> feels like it with this parking lot. We literally lot. drove this is far. I mean, Time Pretty much, yeah. We're heading into Ikea. We're gonna look for some things for the patio because we just figured we're on a roll. Let's like get it done today, you know? We're so adults. We went to Lowe's and now we're at Ikea. And I'm gonna get an Icy as soon as possible. One hour later. Did we really get anything we came here for? No. Did we get a bunch of things we really don't need? Yes. Do I want to run as far away from this place as possible? Oh, we need to get icy. <laughs> yeah, we gotta get icies first. Good morning, it's actually the next day now. Um, I have since showered and fallen asleep on wet hair, so that's what we're dealing with today. But we actually just finished like around a four or five mile walk. We walked up and got some coffee, we walked around, we stopped by Whole Foods on the way home, brought some groceries home, and now we are going to repot all the plants that we were gonna do yesterday. Um, we just ended up coming home and like relaxing, napping, you know, typical Saturday things. The saga continues. We didn't end up finding anything at Ikea that we really wanted. We got like some random stuff, like we got like wooden bowls and like vases, like flower vases. Oh, we got a lamp for our room, I can show that. It's like a typical Ikea lamp, but to me it gives very like 80s postmodern vibes and I'm really into it. So here she is, there's the lamp. We love her. It was actually fantastic to have in here last night. And also, I was reading my Kindle until like 11.30 and I'm like, how many percent? I think I'm like 93% done with Verity by Colleen Hoover. Scandalous. 94% done. So definitely gonna finish that today. I would have finished it last night, but I was literally like falling asleep. So anyways, okay, we're gonna go outside and do some more work because we didn't find the furniture that we were looking for or like the umbrella or anything like that, but it's a slow progress. This isn't gonna be like a back patio reveal. It's just sort of like a documentation. So let's keep going. We're chipping away at it. Okay, these are absolutely not gonna work. They're completely see-through, like trash. I'm gonna have to, I don't know, I threw the packaging away, so don't buy these. Okay, while the sun's coming out, we're taking a quick break to give Layla a bath, which is always like a traumatic time for her. But I just need to show what she actually looks like without like her hair being fluffed up because she looks like a normal sized dog. Are you ready? This is how skinny she is, okay? She is a little, Skinny mini. So for everyone who's like, she's so fat. This is what she actually looks like. Okay, I'm gonna get back to my poor, poor wet dog.
Good morning, everybody. It's a couple days later and the patio is pretty much at like a halt. Like we still need to get more stuff. We did manage to plant all of the flowers and all of the plants. They look amazing, like the veggies and stuff. And I'm so excited to like watch them grow and add more things. We definitely want to add like a ton more plants back there. The privacy fencing we bought didn't end up working out. So we might get like a different one. And then we got the string lights hung up. They look really, really cute. It's going to be so cozy out there for like nighttime. We only hung up one strand because we used to have two in our backyard at our old house and like the backyard was obviously way bigger so that'll like come later on and then we just planted like all of our little flowers and stuff and they just look so cute we're so excited like it's just like a little wildflower patch moment in our backyard and our little back patio and yeah it's definitely like a work in progress but the biggest difference to me anyway is like the rocks that we put back there the river rocks it looks so good i don't even think i showed this but like after we planted all that stuff we gave layla a bath and then we like took her to the park and we laid out a big blanket for all of us so she could like dry off at the park like air dry and we read our books. I finished Verity. It was very intense. I'm excited to like, you know, continue doing patio stuff and I'm just feeling so much better overall. This week is going to be really busy, but next week I'm really excited because Alexa and I are going back to Laguna Beach. We were supposed to stay there back in May, if you remember that vlog, and then like a fire happened and we were kind of like unsure of whether or not it was going to be safe to stay there. So we decided to like postpone the trip, even though we went for the day because we had to like film some content. Anyways, now that postponed trip is here and it's gonna be like a couple days before her birthday too. And then we'll be there on the morning of her actual birthday. So it's gonna be really fun. So I'm just feeling so, I'm feeling like almost a hundred percent better. Like I'm just feeling so grateful for you all for offering me so many words of love and support, like I said before. And to my friends, like, you know, I went to Alexa's house and we went swimming for the day and had so many calls with my best friend and my mom and my dad and Drew and like, you know, so many chats with just amazing people who love and support me. And I feel so, so lucky. Like, I feel like the luckiest girl in the world. Actually, maybe not the luckiest because Moo here, even though he is a boy, um, he's truly living his best life. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna go jump in the shower. Thank you so much for being here and for watching this vlog and I will see you very soon in the next one. Bye.